Hello. Hello. Hello, YouTube. This is Robbie Knight, or Robbie Longcat. Little departure today. I'm not going to do an improvisation or play any keyboards. No, I'm just going to do something that's in here. This is from Maths Gear. This is called the Dodecaplex. Six of these guys. And an instruction manual, brief instruction manual and a nice little carrying thing. This comes from Maths Gear. Uh, Matt Parker from Stand Up Maths. Um, although the original thing is from Henry Segerman and Saul Schleimer. They do a version that which is 3D printed uh, and a bit bigger. This is the Maths Gear um, injection moulded version which is cheaper. 11, 12 quid. Very nice. Okay, there are three solutions possible. I'm going to do all three of those solutions. So, spoiler alert. Spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! It's much more fun if you work it out yourself. It really is a great deal more fun if you work it out yourself. Okay, that was your spoiler alert. Okay, let's have a look. Ah, so the two, two and a half moves that we're going to require are combinations are firstly the head of this guy sits there and then curls around. This I'm calling the snuggle after Matt Parker probably called this the snuggle. It's called the snuggle. Uh, this comes in two different versions, the right-handed and the left-handed. Possibly these should be named after anti-clockwise and clockwise, but I'm not sure which would be which. And because I'm right-handed and this is the one that I find easier to hold, this is the right-handed snuggle. The ring and the pulsar are both solvable with only one chirality of snuggle, either all right-handed or all left-handed. The comet requires some left-handed and some right-handed. Oh, how mysterious. Uh, also, we're going to use this move. I'm calling this the bite. If you imagine this is a little worm, he's got a mouth. He bites into the back halfway along the length of this little worm. Uh, sort of reminds me of a cross bow and arrow, of a bow and arrow as well. This. Anyway, the ring will not require this. I'm going to do the ring first. So let's get our instructions. The ring. The ring. Pop you over there. Right handed. And you can see also as we put more of these right handed snuggles on, it curves. Each one introduces a bit more curve until it curves almost all the way back to the start. Okay, so I've got four on. I'm going to pop this in the middle. This is something we do also with the pulsar, pop stuff in and then get it into the right kind of situation. Okay, so have I been a fool? Have I been a fool? No, I don't think so. There we go. And we twist that round. That's what we want there. And that's what we want there. There you go. The ring, now, ladies and gentlemen. The ring. 
the ring the ring okay very nice let's move on to the comet the comet like I said before is going to involve both left-handed and right-handed snuggles left-handed and right-handed snuggles oh yes a nice cup of tea okay so first the left-handed two in a left-handed and then we're going to have three in a right-handed you could do it the other way around you could have two in a right hand and then three in a left handed okay so two in a left handed this guy is going to bite the topmost one of them right in the middle his other end plops quite nicely next to that one Now we're going to put right-handed snuggles, same way, second notch down, going in that direction, two more, one and one, and then that's us done. Easier said than done though, because partly for this reason, once you've got the first one in, how do you hold it? Okay, let's try putting the second one in. Okay, is that real? That's real. It's a slightly loose fella, is the comet. Uh, I won't throw him about like I threw like I threw the ring about. But there you go. Interesting, interesting shape. I have to say, I really like this. Looking at the front of him, or a front of him. Ah! <laughs> I like he's got that there, but not one there. But oh no, it's already falling apart. Oh no, oh no, oh no! Okay, so. That was the comet. Let's try the pulsar. The pulsar! So, just. A little demonstration of what we're going to do. We're going to do all right handed, two in a right handed snuggle, two in a right handed snuggle, and two in a right handed snuggle. Then this guy is going to bite onto the midpoint of this guy. This guy is going to bite onto the midpoint of this guy, and this guy is going to bite onto the midpoint of this guy. To do it, we're going to leave these separate, but we're going to pick these two up as they are. Two right handed snuggling pairs. So, this is going to bite halfway along this length. And that's all going to slot in quite nicely. It's a bit of a funny one to hold because this one and this one aren't as tightly packed as the other one, so they can get a little bit uh, fluid. Okay, so the other two I'm just going to pop in he's going to go there and he is going to come under there okay so and then we're going to twist these into the right place this one first this i want to bite onto this guy and it's going to be bitten by this one so in particular has to be underneath that so let's twist that around if we can. Can we? Oh, not quite. It's got to be bitten exactly halfway along its length, as well as it is biting exactly halfway along the length of the one that it is biting. So there you go, he's bitten that. He's being bitten halfway along his length. Let's just have a look at our other. Not yet properly placed fella. Easier to look at on the 
other side on the other side okay yes here we go there he is and we want to bite onto the halfway point of this guy we're gonna go under this guy okay go under be bitten by okay so twisting that around there we go that might be it he's in there he's under there and he's there bom 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 the pulsar the pulsar the pulsar the pulsar do like the pulsar you have these the two snuggling and then a gap the two snuggling then a gap the two snuggling you can imagine if it was spinning and if it had a light source in the middle of it it would send out pulses of light like a pulsar does Woo! okay so there is the pulsar there is the pulsar okay this has been a departure from my normal YouTube self don't really do puzzly things but I got this and I've had a lot of fun with it so I wanted to share the solution with you so thank you very much thank you very much thank you very much bom 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 bom